Hello and welcome to episode 2 of the 100 coding challenges in C Sharp. This episode is called Hello Name. The challenge in this episode is to write a program to take the user's name and display the message Hello Name. For example, if the user types in Jack, the program should display Hello Jack. For bonus points, you can add more sentences to greet your user such as Nice to meet you Jack or Have a good day Jack. If you want to attempt this by yourself, then hit pause on the video now. Okay, so let's get straight into it. I actually like to ask the question to the user first. This wasn't part of the challenge, but it would be good to do it as it would make the application a little bit more user friendly. So I'm just going to teach you a little shortcut here. Instead of writing out console.write line, you can actually write CW and then hit the tab button twice, and that will automatically fill out the console.write line code for you. And then within here, we can say, What is your name? And then on the next line, we want to actually read the name that the user inputs into the console. So what we're going to start off with is actually declaring a variable. So we're going to be using a string type variable and we're going to be calling this name. You can also do this using var, but for best practice, we're going to be explicitly saying the type of the variable. So let's do So this function here, console.readline, will wait for the user's input before carrying on, and it will take that input and assign it to the variable name. So we could have named this whatever we wanted. We could have named this, you know, Bob or Tin or Can, and it would have done the same thing. We can still make use of it later on in our code. And then what we want to do is output this back to the user saying, hello, whatever their name is. So once again, I'm going to use this cw tab tab okay so there's actually two different ways you could have done this one is using string interpolation and putting a dollar sign up before your a string and then you're able to put variables within curly braces and it will know to print out that variable in that place Another way you could have done this without this is to have hello using string concatenation with a plus adding name at the end of that line. These two lines of code would achieve the exact same thing. So if we go ahead and run this. The console asks me what is your name and I'm going to say my name is Jack and then it will print back saying hello Jack. Now if any of you did the bonus rounds it's very simple what we do is just have another console that write line afterwards and we could say and if we run that we can do the same thing again. My name is Jack. Hello, Jack. Have a nice day, Jack. And there we go. That's the end of episode two. Another very easy one to get us going. If you enjoyed this episode, remember to subscribe to the channel, hit the thumbs up. And if you like, leave a comment down below to let us know how you got on. And I'll see you guys in the next one.